Let's take a look at a couple of examples. So the question is, what is the difference between three and minus four? So this question could cause a few issues because of negative numbers. So if you're struggling with negative numbers, draw out a number line. So starting at zero, remember we are increasing as we go to the right and we are decreasing as we go to the left. So we want three and minus four. So all we need to do is count the steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So the difference between three and minus four, which is the same as the difference between minus four and three, is seven. For this question, we've been asked to measure the car. So all we need to do is put a ruler down, make sure that zero is perfectly in line with one end of the picture, and take a look and see where the other end is in line. Not always that easy, particularly if it's a kind of uh, an irregular shape. Obviously, if it's just a straight line, it's much easier because you can get your ruler really up close to it. So as we can see that this has a measurement of 10 centimeters, assuming of course that this is a ruler that is measured in centimeters.